Hi, I'm Frank and this is Tiki and welcome back to Building a Builder. Today we're going to be doing a fun video where we're going to see how many cars a Lego locomotive can pull. What do you think Tiki? Are you ready to do this? Yeah. Why? We're going to use the newest freight train locomotive to test out the capabilities of a Lego train locomotive. And here, Tiki, you want to show us the, uh, the different cars that uh, we're going to be testing? So we have the locomotive, and then we have the newest ones that just came out not too long ago with the car carrier. And then we get to some of the older ones, which is the uh, front end loader train car, the logs, the wires, some barrels, gas car, just some more cargo. Then we have the cattle car. We have another one, an engine on a car that's also very old. Just a standard uh, box car. Here we have some more octane, a wheelbarrow, a another cargo which looks like a little tractor and the caboose and this is uh, actually our from our oldest set now if we run out of these and we need more uh, there's some other ones we can uh, kind of scrounge up to see how many it goes with all right let's uh let's start with three all right Tiki are you ready to go we have three cars on our locomotive all right go ahead and, and uh, press the plus sign Press the plus. All right, plus stop. So it could definitely do three cars, which is what, what we thought. All right, go ahead and uh, press the minus sign. So now we're gonna add this car to it. All right, Tiki, go ahead and press the plus button. The, pr the plus button, yes. All right, so we can do five. All right, hit stop. All right, now we're gonna grab our next car, which is the crane car. All right, Tiki, go ahead and press the the plus button, yes. All right, no problem. All right, stop. So let's take a look at the controller here. Tiki, do you wanna show them? Show, show us the controller. All right, you have to move your fingers. Here we go. So you can see here the plus button on the left makes it go forward. The red just makes it stop and then the minus makes it go backwards. All right, here you go. All right, hold on. We're gonna go get our next car, which is gonna be the log car. All right, Tiki, let's go ahead and uh, press the plus sign. Plus sign. All right, stop. All right, now we're gonna do our next car, which is the uh, rolls of wire. <clears throat> All right, Tiki, let's go ahead and press the plus button. All right, stop. So it's starting to struggle a little bit going backwards. All right, stop. But so far, we're up to seven cars. So now we're on to the barrels. All right, Tiki, go ahead and hit this, the plus sign. All right, stop. So our ninth car is this octane car. All right, go ahead and press, there you go. So it's doing nine, no problem. I know, that's the Hogwarts train. You don't want to crash into it. The train she's talking about is the Hogwarts Express. Yeah. Right here, down here. The 
last one we have so far and we have to scrounge up some new ones. to get some more i have some passenger cars i can add on to it so uh just give us a second and we'll uh add those on so we found some more cars this is actually just a battery car used to propel one of the original train sets which is uh this locomotive right here there's actually a wire that went from down in here that powered the wheels over to that car uh, now we also have these passenger cars, so we have four of these, so that's five more we can add. And then later we're going to try to see how many engines it can pull because engines have a lot more resistance than just regular cars. Okay Tiki, we're going to add the 16th car, so he's really struggling with 16 cars, but he's moving. Alright, stop. So now we're going to add our first passenger car, right here. Keep pressing it. So yeah, that was 18 cars that this thing was able to pull so far. Uh, we're going to add another one. Now it may have been because of this turn here that made it more challenging for the car to get going, the train to get going. Keep pressing it. Huh. I have to go faster. So yeah. he's able to move 19 cars. Okay. Which one? Hit it some more. Keep hitting it. Are you still going? Uh, Alright, stop. So we're doing 21 cars. Go ahead and press the stop or the, the plus sign. Keep pressing. Keep pressing. This is 21 cars. Alright, stop. Now the only thing left I have are the engines. We have a really old engine pretty old engine and then these newer passenger engines and these other cargo engines and down here we also have the crocodile locomotive but he's gonna stay down there too okay so what we're gonna try this time for 22 cars is we're gonna add this locomotive which is not under power at the moment it's going to be powered by this one. We're putting it in front. So, okay, Tiki, hit the plus button. Okay. Faster. So it's moving it. But I think that's it. I think 22 with the with the engine in front is its limit. So here we're going to try to back up with it. So I didn't notice, but it looks like these cars got detached when it was going. So 21 cars minus the engine is the limit of what, with these cars anyway, the cars that we attach to it, which are all just standard Lego train cars. But the locomotive was too much. The extra locomotive was too much. Now the locomotive was powered, it was probably be able to pull quite a bit more. All right, so now we're gonna see how many locomotives one Lego locomotive can pull at one time. So we're gonna start out with this one right here. All right, go ahead and hit the plus button. Keep pressing. 
so that takes more all right hit stop so that took a lot more effort than a whole bunch of uh just regular cars but these have a lot of resistance resistance on them because they're they have their motor inside all right now hit the plus sign keep pressing it keep pressing it all right stop so again it had a little bit more resistance so it's done two so far which is a uh, pretty impressive all right now back it up again hit the minus sign and we're gonna go over and we're gonna hook up to this one and see if it can pull this one too keep pressing keep pressing so we can't we appear not to be able to back up with two does so it, does it want? we'll try the third one going forward to see how that goes okay go ahead and hit the press the plus There we go. All right, stop. I don't want it crash into that one. Okay. So it can pull three <laughs> locomotives, twenty-one regular cars. So these things are pretty. Uh, these things are pretty strong. Uh, the turns do matter. Um, it, as all. It goes. It goes super fast. How fast does it go? It goes super fast. <laughs> yeah, it does. How what do you think? Would you like the trains? Yeah. You like playing with the trains? And, and these trains, this train don't have engine. Where is? It has an engine. It just doesn't have any batteries in it. It goes in here, but we only put batteries in this one because it takes so many, and it uh, tends to drain them pretty fast. So um, we don't keep batteries in our trains unless we're actually going to use them. Well,